Leadership is the lifeblood that fuels the Marine Corps. And as a leader, you're here to support, you're here to help and assist that individual Marine. You mentor people to better them. You have to appreciate the Marine, you have to mentor the Marine, you have to groom the Marine. But in order for you to be a leader, you have to be the example. You have to live the life that you want the Marines to live. Your standards might be a little different than mine, or you know, Gunner Sergeant Shepherds might be a little different than mine. Good leadership is how you respond to something bad happening at that lowest level. And if they do make a mistake, they're going to learn from their mistakes and they're going to take responsibility for it. Every Marine is different. Every Marine leader is different. Down at the basic level, we can't, while we all wear the same uniform and we all have the same goals and we all have the same uh, love of our core, we go about it differently. And leadership is a very individual thing. It's important to be good at your job and it's important to have leaders that show a good example for that for the, for the, for the Marines that they're in charge of. But we want more than that. We want leaders to show true concern uh, for the Marines that they have uh, in their units. Marines will die for each other. Uh, Marines will go to battle no matter what. Because if we're not morally, you know, ethically, emotionally, legally sound, then we really can't be a total warrior. You're a Marine, and that's it. How do we actually make leaders? Here's this new thing called leadership development, and here's what you can do with it. And you're really only limited by your imagination. Many things that we ask Marines to do, leaders and individual Marines, tend to be another rock in the pack. Here's one more thing that you have to do. I see leadership development as being an opportunity to take some of those rocks out. You're not directed to, you know, every time you talk to a Marine, write something down. Create it and make it as successful as you want to. Uh, not only will I think it have tangible results on the battlefield, a combat situation, but it will have tangible results throughout the span of a Marine's career. I can tailor it to the needs and the uh, uh, the different uh, requirements of the individuals in the unit or uh, the talents or shortfalls of the guys. The onus is on each individual unit. I think we just need to leave the Marine Corps a better place than we found it.